In a world that often feels like a turbulent sea, where waves of uncertainty, fear and darkness strive to overshadow our peace, there is a steadfast beacon of hope that shines unwaveringly, the power of prayer for protection against evil. This is no ordinary prayer. It is a divine shield, an invisible armor that gently surrounds and protects our hearts, minds and souls from the forces that seek to harm us. Picture yourself not on a battlefield with worldly weapons, but with a faith so profound it can move mountains and a prayer strong enough to shatter the chains of darkness. This is the promise God extends to each of us, a promise of protection, strength and peace amid life's storms. It is a promise to hold on to, to stand upon and to call upon in our moments of need. If you believe that God can make a difference in your life today, let us unite in faith. I will pray earnestly with you in the mighty name of Jesus. Stay with me until the end and open your heart to receive the blessings of this prayer. Scripture offers us profound assurance in Psalm 91, Walmney to 2. He who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress, my God, in him I will trust. These verses remind us that our safety is not secured by the strength of our walls or the might of our armies, but by our closeness to God, our choice to remain in his presence and our trust in his sovereign power. Drawing from the depths of divine assurance, we can approach each day with a confidence that transcends our circumstances, anchored in the reality of God's unchanging character and unfailing promises. When we pray for protection against evil, we are not simply uttering words into the void. We are engaging in a profound act of faith, declaring that God is our protector, our shield, and our ever-present help in times of trouble. This act of faith is beautifully expressed in Psalm 119.1.147 I rise before dawn and cry for help, I hope in your word. Here lies the key to unlocking the power of prayer for protection. Beginning each day by seeking God, acknowledging our need for His guidance and protection, and placing our hope in His word. It is a declaration that before we face the world, we choose to face God to seek His presence and to stand on the truth of His promises. In making this choice, we join a chorus of believers throughout history who have found refuge in the shadow of the Almighty, witnessed the dismantling of strongholds and experienced deliverance from the grasp of evil. Our prayers become the channel through which God's power is released, His peace is imparted and His protection is activated in our lives. So, my friends, let us not underestimate the power of praying for protection against evil. It is a prayer that acknowledges our vulnerability, but also proclaims our victory. It recognizes the reality of evil while reaffirming the supremacy of God. As we commit ourselves to this prayer, let us do so with the assurance that God hears, cares and acts on behalf of those who put their trust in Him. My dear friends, let this be the moment we choose to stand firm, lift our voices in prayer, and embrace the protection that comes from dwelling in the secret place of the Most High. As we do, let us move forward with the assurance that, no matter what we encounter, we are covered, held, and protected by Almighty God, our refuge and fortress. Now to all those hearing my voice, let us approach the Lord in prayer. I invite you to join me in this prayer so you may receive its blessings. You may also listen to this prayer daily as you strengthen your faith and come into agreement. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, almighty and everlasting God, I come before you this morning, lifting my voice in joyful praise for who you are. You are the creator of the heavens and the earth the King of kings and Lord of lords, mighty in power and rich in mercy. I thank you, Lord, for your unfailing love and faithfulness that greet me each morning. Your mercies are new every day, and for this I am eternally grateful. 
As I enter your presence, I seek forgiveness for my sins and for the times I have fallen short of your glory. I also choose to forgive those who have wronged me, releasing any bitterness or hurt in my heart. In the quiet of this morning, I declare you as my refuge and fortress, my God in whom I trust. Lord, help me to remain under your shadow, confident in your protection from the snares of the enemy. Surround me with your shield of faith, that all the fiery darts of the wicked may be extinguished. Grant me wisdom and discernment to navigate this world, to recognize deceit and lies, and to make decisions that honor your name. Give me strength and courage to face the battles of this day. Confound every voice that speaks negativity over my life, for when I am weak, you are strong, and in your strength I can do all things. Let your peace, which surpasses all understanding, guard my heart and mind in Christ Jesus. In the midst of turmoil, your peace remains unshaken, a steady anchor for my soul. Send your angels to encamp around me and my loved ones, protecting us from harm and guiding our steps. I stand against every form of evil that seeks to invade my life. In the mighty name of Jesus, I rebuke the forces of darkness, the spirit of fear, the chains of anxiety, and the lies of insecurity. I declare victory over every challenge and stronghold, for greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. I pray for healing for myself and for all who are suffering, believing that by your stripes we are healed. Lord, as I say this prayer together with everyone listening, I am grateful for every heart humbled before you. We come in agreement, knowing that where two or three are gathered in your name, you are in our midst. Bless each one listening, Lord. Cover us with your protection, fill us with your Holy Spirit, and let your will be done in our lives. We pray for our loved ones, that they too may experience your grace, protection, and healing. For those facing trials and tribulations, remind us that you are our ever-present help. We stand firm in the knowledge that no weapon formed against us shall prosper. We declare healing over every sickness, provision in times of need, and peace amid the storms. We are more than conquerors through him who loves us. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. If you were blessed by this prayer, please type the word Amen in the comments section below. I declare that all the blessings of this prayer are now upon you in the name of Jesus. You can help us reach more people and spread the gospel by sharing this video with a friend or family member and by clicking the like button. Also, remember to subscribe to our channel for more content that will bless your heart and uplift your spirit. We deeply appreciate your support. You are blessed to be a blessing. Feel free to leave your prayer requests in the comments so that we can present them before God for your blessings and victory. This also allows other believers on YouTube and around the world to join us in praying for you. Stand in faith with us as we pray. To God be all the glory. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all.